What's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. In this one, we're going to go over all the unreleased camos that we have in the files right now and we'll be releasing very soon. We're also going to talk about the brand new season three camos. There's a lot of them. We actually know how you're going to be able to unlock what they look like and when they're going to be available. And I got all the details for you guys here in today's video. If you find it helpful or informative, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. A quick reminder, I did a similar video to this, but with the free operators that you're going to be able to claim starting right now, as well as in the future of season three. If you missed that video, I'll have it linked down in the description. We have over 10 different operators and bundles and you definitely don't want to miss out on them. So I'll have that available in the description. Check it out after this video. Before we get into it, a quick word from our sponsor, MessyModdingStore.com. It's a store that can get you the most exclusive operators, help you complete your mastery camo challenges and much more. And the reason why I promote them is they do everything 100% legit without using mods or unlock tools. And not to mention they have some of the best reviews. So check them out. The link will be down in the description. The very first camo that we have is called the Golden Cheetah. This is an early showcasing of what that camo is gonna look like it looks really sick sadly it's not animated there's different angles that you can see here it definitely does glow depending on the lighting and where you're at and it's super bright in terms of the golden color it may be oddly familiar to you because this actually was a camo in world war ii and if you guys recall we did get something like this similar in the past where they added one of the mastery camos from a past call of duty title but behind a paywall they're doing the same thing here so to unlock this you're actually gonna have to spend quite a bit of cash and here's what you have to do it says free in-game content if you go over to the call of duty shop website this will pop up it'll say gold cheetah maximize your loadout and spend a hundred dollars site-wide to unlock the gold cheetah weapon camo exclusions apply and when you do purchase everything it'll give you this notification saying thank you for your purchase your gold cheetah weapon camo will arrive soon codes will be delivered via email to the email address provided when ordering code delivery is not instant codes will be distributed upon fulfillment of the complete order and may be delayed by product of availability so if you are interested in it you have to go to the call of duty shop and just spend the hundred dollars and then they will send you a code in which you can redeem at calldude.com slash redeem and then you will end up getting this camo the next camo that we have will actually be animated this is called the allegiances camo it has a bunch of different blue icons and they're actually just moving all around you can see this from the footage and what to do to unlock this is complete all eight weekly challenges very similar to the rotten inferno camo that was available in season two this time it's going to be this one if you're interested in getting it definitely start your weekly challenges early because once that last week of season three starts you only have a one week window to complete the week eight challenges and any other weeks prior to that that you haven't completed yet and then it goes away permanently once the season four update starts but this is what the animated camo will look like we got early footage of it the next thing that we have warzone rank season three camos depending on the rank that you place at your very peak so say for example the highest rank you place was diamond and then you fell down to gold you will unlock the diamond camo and every single rank will have a different color to match that theme unfortunately they're not animated up until you get to iridescent so you have gold you have plat you have diamond you have crimson and they're just flat out solid camos which are like a topographic type of style that they got going on and then once you get to iridescent they actually start looking insane this is going to be an animated version of it and it looks like a 420 type of event it has all these different colors and it just looks really sick and i thought this might be an early preview to the new mastery camos that call of duty ended up announcing if you guys don't know about that i'm gonna cover it in a little bit more detail towards the end of the video but this is what the iridescent camo will look like then there's the top 250 that will also be animated and in order to unlock these you're gonna have to be really good and place iridescent or top 250 so this camo is gonna be pretty exclusive and not many people are gonna be able to unlock it unless you're skilled enough to get to these ranks if you want to go through these camos and see them for yourself you can go through the warzone ring tab and you can check them out there the next camo that we have is gonna be available on rebirth island and this will require you to do the rebirth new contract quest if you fully complete that contract you will be able to not only unlock that operator that we talked about yesterday but you actually end up getting this camo unfortunately it's not the best one probably in my opinion one of the worst camos in this entire video but you have to do some of the hardest work in order to unlock it it's not animated it's not reactive it doesn't even have bright colors it's just like a regular typical standard camo that yeah that's it but this is what it will look like an orange and blue type of color good news is this isn't the only new quest camo that you can unlock if you actually do the nuke on years extend there's a new camo called the nuking hazard that you're going to be able to get this one is a lot more bright you have pink purple blue a little bit of yellow and orange it's not animated i wasn't able to get any footage of it but i was able to confirm that it's not an animated camo and these are the photos that we have of it but what are your thoughts and opinions you think this one's way better than the other one the next camo that we have this one is called the welcome to the mainframe camo in order to unlock this you will have to 
do the daily logins with the biometric scanners. There's biometric scanners, 10 of them spread around the map on Rebirth Island. You have to go there every single real life day and scan it and get a key card. You don't have to do anything with the key card as long as you scan that biometric scanner, it will count for the day. Every couple days, you'll end up getting a reward. I did discuss and talk about and cover all that in a past video, which I'll have linked down in the description. The final reward at 27 days of doing this will unlock you this brand new camo. Jumping into the next one that we have, this is actually an animated camo. This is called the Binary Morality Event Camo. And that's right, this is gonna be a part of an event, probably one of the better camos that they've added with this update. It's fully animated, red, black, and yellow. And on top of that, this is gonna be a free camo that you can unlock. You don't have to do anything crazy. It's gonna be a part of the Virus and Mainframe Vortex event. The event is currently scheduled after this high trip event that we have going on right now. So you can probably expect it to be around two weeks from now. It is arriving before the season three reloaded update goes live. It's gonna be an XP based event, meaning this will be the mastery reward. You simply play the game, gain as much XP as possible. And once you hit that XP goal, you will be able to unlock this brand new animated camo. Speaking of event camos, there is one that you can get right now. This one is called the That's A Lot Of Molecules Camo. It's a part of the High Trip Resurgence mode. It's a secret challenge where if you win one game of High Trip Resurgence, you will end up unlocking it. One thing I need to let you guys know though, is that apparently when you got the win yesterday, it was bugged out. It didn't track. I ended up getting the win. I didn't get the camo. I saw a lot of comments, people saying the same thing. Even leakers over on Twitter said the same thing. And they saw in the files that the challenge is still the same. It didn't change. It's just apparently bugged. But then he tweeted around 20, 30 minutes ago. And he said that correction, this bug has been fixed. And if you get the win, it should now track properly. So you should be good to go in terms of getting it. Maybe you'll have to redo and get that win once again in order to be able to get the camo. But once you do, you will be able to unlock it. And it just matches that whole 420 theme. On top of all these camos that I have shown you, those are all the ones that we know how you can unlock and when they're expected to release. These following camos, we have no idea when they're set to release. Some of them have been in the files for a couple of seasons now. This first one right here is called the Thirsty Luck Camo, which was supposed to release, it looks like, during St. Patrick's Day. And maybe they were scheduling an event for that and then they ended up scrapping it. I have no idea. It just matches the theme. St. Patrick's Day ended around a month ago, so it's looking like a very likely chance this may end up being a scrapped camo. They decided not to release it for some reason, but it's just still sitting there in the files. Usually if a camo is scrapped, they will end up removing it. At this moment, it's still available. So maybe it could end up being a free reward sometime in the next upcoming seasons, updates, weeks. We'll know a little bit more because usually with camos like these, they'll introduce random weekly events where they'll advertise maybe an operator skin or something in the store and do an XP based event and then you're able to get it. It's the same exact case with the blue steel camo. We thought it was going to be launching in with the Warhammer 40k. It matches the color theme. It just never ended up happening. Instead, they gave us a weapon blueprint. This ended up just sitting in the files. It hasn't been removed. Potentially, this could also be a camo that they will be adding within a random update as well. And then there's on the Regal camos that we have. They look a little bit similar, but there is the Royal Mess camo and the Regal Death camo. And these are yet to release as well. And these actually look very sick. Uh, they match like that Golden Cheetah type of skin style that we saw in the very beginning of the video. So these are also potential releases that we could see sometime. Then there's that animated Windfall camo, which was added in the very beginning of MW3. And we are still yet to get any sort of release on that. I don't think a camo this good would go to waste. They're probably holding onto it for a particular event. As of right now, we're just not sure. It's still sitting in the files. People are still able to access it with like unlock tools, but there's no legitimate way to unlock it. So we'll have to wait and see how you'll be able to get it. Anyways, other than these camos that you see here, it looks like Sledgehammer did confirm in a creator call that they are planning to release a new set of mastery challenges. This means a new set of mastery camos, and they are going to be rewarded for players who are able to do the zombies mastery and the multiplayer mastery so i guess it's like a prerequisite to get both those mastery sets first and then you will be able to get this new set they didn't show photos they haven't provided anything other than that more than likely they're gonna have their own set of challenges maybe there's gonna be four camels total that you'll be able to get this is probably gonna be something they may introduce in like season four or five i think anytime after five is gonna be way too late for them to put in new masteries but we'll see we'll find out once we get a little bit more information i got you guys covered with a video but as of right now now, these are all the upcoming camos that we know of. If there's any additional information, I always got you guys covered. So don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. But it's been your boy Chido. Thank you guys for tuning in. And hopefully I'll be seeing you guys back on the channel again. Peace.